Hey people, so <laughs> I'm having a really good day. Um not you know, not great, but good. You know, with my crappy t shirt. But <laughs> anyways, I wanted to talk about a email I got this morning, which just made my day even more fun. Um <laughs> Um I got a... Uh, my day has is, is, is been weird. Um, it started off with um, a message from my girl in Canada, uh, which was always nice. Um, and then it proceeded by getting an email um, about a business thing I'm working on, where I'm now moving to step two uh, into the testing phase. Um, and... Ugh. And so I got some some work to do there. Um, then um, I again talked to my girl in Canada and have some have her do some stuff and <laughs> waiting for the photos on that. Um, and then I get an email from my girl in Utah uh, with photos of some things that are going to be you're going to be seeing on the, these videos just being given to me in a very specific way. Um, if you can't read really between the lines on that when you see what they are, <laughs> really. Anyways, I got a message from somebody who I will leave, leave nameless because I just think the person's pathetic. Um, <laughs> but the, the, the title of the message is, You're a Pervert. <laughs> and then the message goes on to rant and rail against me and specifically what I promote within the BDSM community. Um, apparently they stumbled across my uh, How to Join Fet video. And then just started looking at all the different videos that I did, and because <laughs> she, ref I'm guessing it's a she by the name, she referenced many of my videos, um, specific details in the videos that only somebody who had watched the videos would have um, would have known. <laughs> And I just read this thing, and I, I had to stop myself from laughing. I mean, I just had to stop myself from, from just busting out laughing, because it was just the just not understanding anything about what it is we do. And just, you know, just making all of these accusations about how I'm perverted, how I'm sick, how I'm corrupting people, how I'm ruining people's lives, how I'm ruining people's marriages, how I'm doing all of these horrible, nasty things. And I sent a one-word reply back, and I haven't heard from him yet, but who knows when something will show up. Um, my one-word reply was, thanks. Because <laughs> the thing about it is, is that, except for the ruining people's lives, what I do is the exact opposite of ruin people's lives. I help people discover who it is and what they are. Um, <laughs> I, I, I can claim multiple marriages because of me being destroyed. Um, thing is, is that it's not me. I just happen to be the catalyst. I happen to be the spark. And it, it's not, it's not that it's ruining the marriage. The marriage was ruined way before I even got involved. I'm just giving a different solution to being happy. 
doing what I do makes me happy and enjoy life. And a person like this, <laughs> they're, they're leading a miserable life. I mean, just miserable, miserable life. I mean, that's the only way you can explain it, is that they have a miserable, miserable life. To sit and think that what we're doing is wrong is, 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 is funny. And, and as for the charge of being perverted, I'm a pervert. I know it. I know it for a fact. I know what I am. I know who, what I do, and it is perverted. Therefore, I am a pervert. <laughs> it's, it, it's just amazing that even with as much information as I try to put out, as much work as I do on these videos, as much, you know, as much as you know, as much as it happens. I mean, yes, I've. You know, these videos have been spotty, um, which I'm, I've am i been trying to change, and now I actually have a financial motive to try to change that. Um, <laughs> it's a whole other story. But I know what it is I do. I know what I promote. I know all of these things. You don't have to sit there and point out all of these things. I know. <laughs> I... The thing is, is that you're seeing it from a different point of view. From a different... Ideas. The set of ideas. A set of standards and different moralities than what we do. Our set... Uh, we have a very high set of standards. A very high, you know, high um, form of morality. But we're perverts, we're perverted. When we take a household item and use it for play, it's called a pervertible. <laughs> There's whole forums on FET and other places about how to take household items and use them for play. Um, something eventually I gotta do, and if somebody wants to sponsor this, please do so. Um... I want to do the $20 challenge, uh, and if you don't know what the $20 challenge is, is going into your local dollar store. We have the 99 cent only store here, so it's kind of like the, uh, the 99 cent only store is kind of like the Bloomingdale's of crappy dollar stores, <laughs> you know, th this is the Tiffany's of, of crappy dollar stores, so you know, I love going in and no other toys, no nothing. And just taking the $20 and buying 19 or 20 items and I'll have to use use them in the same night. I, I just think that that right there, if that doesn't show the level of perversion that we have, I don't know what else. We are perverts. We do things that society sees as sick and dangerous. And the thing about it is, is that we don't shy away from that. We revel in it. We like knowing that we have a dirty little secret. We like knowing that what we're doing, you don't know. Right now, as I speak to you, I have my girl in Canada. Has butt plug her panties are sitting on, on pulled up her ass her breasts are out of her bra and she's working in an office and to everybody else it just looks like she's wearing her normal clothes but in reality she has these dirty little secrets you know she's wearing her you know, the camisole and the work shirt so no one can could tell what was going on with her breast no one's going to notice that she pulls up her skirt when she's sitting behind the desk. Okay? No one's going to notice these things. No one's going to care. But the thing is that she knows she has a dirty little secret. And we revel in this. 
We don't shove it in your face. We don't make you do it. We don't want you to do it. Please, stay away from us. Get away from us. Go away. Move to a different state. Move to a different country. Move to whatever. If that's if the, our mere existence is going to make the, your life that miserable, but we don't care. We're not here to please you. We're not here to please anybody but ourselves. To make ourselves happy. And if that sounds selfish, damn right. Because as I've said before, everything we do is selfish. I don't care what it is you do. You're doing it for selfish reasons. And if you can acknowledge that and you understand it, then everything you do has purpose. From the littlest things that I would ask somebody to do, from the littlest things that I would ask somebody to say, the littlest things I would ask somebody to wear, all have purpose. And if you can't handle that idea, move on. Find something different. That life is too short. You only live once. Enjoy it. Be happy. Be healthy. Take care of yourself. Take care of your friends. Take care of your family. And this may sound, you know, opposite of what I just said, but no. Because helping somebody feels good. There's a reason. There's there's your selfish reason. I want to do something to feel good good screaming at somebody doesn't accomplish anything yelling at someone accomplishes nothing we revel in what we do we enjoy what we do we live for what we do and for somebody out there who is going to go and nitpick and distort and lie about what it is I do, I feel sorry for you. I am perfect. I enjoy it. I love it. But the only people I do this stuff with are people who also enjoy it and love it. I don't put it out in public. I don't make people get involved who don't want to get involved. We have a thing called consent. But we love it. And if you can't handle it, like I said, I feel sorry for you. That's it for now. Do all that stuff. Subscribe. Uh, find me on Fed. Um, like I said, I have a new, a new thing there. Um, just take this name, Matter and YT, on the back of it and look for me there. Subscribe, like, favor, blah, 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 all that standard stuff. But that's it for now. Be well and safe.